Travel Adventures with Marilyn and Craig. While researching YouTube on places to travel and things to see, we found some interesting sites. But the information about those locations and what to do once you get there was always a little limited. I love to take pictures. And I love shooting video. And, and we, we both love, love to, to travel. travel. So what could be better than to share our travel adventures on YouTube for those of you that want to learn from our experiences. Homer, Alaska is renowned for its halibut salmon fishing, but if there's a day when you can't fish, a day trip to Soldovia is a nice excursion. The building where you buy the tickets is a little hard to find because the city won't let the ferry company place a sign on the main street. But if you find the deep water launch site, the ticket building is on that road. The round trip excursion costs about $80 per person. Reservations are not required, but are recommended on holiday weekends. All right, so this is the catamaran we're going across over to uh, Solda Sol Soldavia. Soldovia. However you say the damn place. It's Russian, I don't speak Russian. The catamaran is new, built in 2005, with comfortable seating, and they provide free coffee during your excursion. Salty Dog Bar. And this is the skipper up here. He's got controls right in front of him. The ferry to Soldovia is a catamaran, and that means smooth sailing. Business on the back lot, only $239,000, and uh, it seems to be for sale right now. Location, location, location. 
The historic boardwalk has shops and residents that date back to the beginning of the town. Soldovia dates back to 1787 or 1788 and was a Russian fishing and fur trappers outpost. Today, in addition to fishing, it also caters to tourists and photographers. Scenic relics of a bygone age are located around the town. I see one. Oh yeah, and I video I'm videotaping it right now. That's a good looking fish. Bring a rod and reel and try your hand at a little salmon fishing right from the shore. Sea otters are cute and a common sight in and around the Soldovia Bay. It's going to put on a little show here, rolling over a couple times. Oh, it's waving. Hi, hey Marilyn, how are you? Can I get the good grease? Are you cooking real? Or? You cook it the best way to cook it. Put it in some olive oil, roll it in fresh potato chips. Bake it, yeah. Uh, and in squares. In squares, okay. Oh. Corn checks. For how long? Ten minutes or seven minutes. Four hundred. Four hundred.
The ferry runs daily from Homer at 11 a.m. and returns at 4.30 p.m. For those who want to stay overnight in Soldovia, the ferry returns to Homer at 9 a.m. Occasionally, on the way back, the skipper will take a different route, and visitors will see sea otters or even whales. Uh, there's one right there. Two of them. Oh, my goodness!
All in all, the day trip to Soldovia was a success and a nice relaxing excursion. Now, that's what I call parallel parking right yeah. there. That is remarkable. I can't even believe how fast that guy put he that in there. Put it right in there. You could do the same thing with your car, fall four, your wheels swivel. Yeah. No, no, I doubt that I could. <laughs> I, somebody could, but it wouldn't be me.